Okay, let's do this. What did you do this weekend? <laughs> Easy. I'm just sitting here doing my homework. Mush my little brother in a meat mush. No! Not little brother. I don't want to mush him. Ugh, focus, Sam. Homework. What did you do this weekend? Easy. Just workshop my stand-up set. Ahem. What time do ducks wake up? Oh, no! Did I already mush him? I need to check. Check, check. I need to check. What time do ducks? I need to check. I need to check. I need to check. I need to check. Good morning. Today is another fantastic day, just perfect in every way. Nothing bad happening anywhere in the world for you to worry about. It's all love and peace and hugs. And don't forget kittens who live forever. Don't even think about it. <laughs> ah, kittens don't die. We're all the same being. We're all the same person. Looking through billions and billions of different faces. Hmm. How do you think about that, Mary Jane? But well, I think it's poignant. For Bartholomew, little brother. Okay, okay. You are okay. Yeah, I'm fine. What's up? I'm great. I, I didn't mush you into into meat. I didn't mush you into meat. Nope, not at all. Uh, well, can I get you anything? A drink? A snack? Meat mush! Do you need anything? Anything at all? No thanks. Okay. Mm. Okay, mush. But what about duck? Do you know what time? What time did the duck... What duck are you referring to? It's a joke. Uh, what time did the duck wake up? Time is a human construct. Okay, well, if you're sure I didn't already mush you into mush, I should go back to my homework at the quack of dawn. That's when ducks... Butts, butts, butts. And now, you can buy your own Debbie Cats. Straight soap. You're our best friend. Mush my entire family in the meat wash. No, mush my entire family in the meat wash. No, mush my entire family in the meat wash. No! Why do I keep having such terrible thoughts? Why am I such a terrible kid and can't even tell a funny joke or do my homework or anything? <laughs> Straight so You're our best friend. Disaster started when I wrote a letter to Maria Bamford. I've always been a big fan and asked her if she wanted to collaborate on an animated something. I sent her a big document full of half ideas and art. She said yes. Maria and I met at a coffee shop one morning and wrote a 20 page script. Then I did lots of drawings, developing the characters and ideas further. She wanted a non-binary child as a main character who is not brave and suffers from severe obsessive compulsive disorder. A character children with similar situations could relate to. So we created Sam. Straight soap. You're our best friend. 